so it turns out that yes, <coughs> Hatram does become a fairy type, so that's nice. Alright then. Polygon 2. Uh, just fine with, I suppose. Maybe it doesn't have side beam yet. Okay, you're going to be very annoying, I'll switch it. It does have side beam, but it chose not to use it. Alright, take this. Yeah, it evolves into a psychic fairy type, so that's good to know. So now we have a fairy type, and now I just need a question mark, question mark. Whatever type I can get, you know? It would be nice if it was a shiny as well. So I'm going to be looking for shinies, I suppose. Alright, take down. No, I don't want that. And Shockwave is better than Thundershock, so yeah, I'll, I'll take that. Alright, then we defeated Young Sir Joey. No, I don't want to look at the decks now. Alright, so that means I can now use Hat 2. Hatram! Okay, anyway. Alright, let me just um, get into the fight. Here we are. Um, I guess I'll use Confusion on you and Shockwave on the Hatram, I guess. Because you have one too. Take this. Dead. Alright. For it is going to go down eventually. Confusion. Okay, what's next? What else you got? Fletch Ender. That's fine. I can just Thundershock that thing. Alright, Confusion on the for it. And Shockwave on the Fletchender, which is spelled wrong because the name is longer than the thing allows. So they had they had to spell Fletchender wrong because the name is longer than the 10 character limit you have in this generation. That's quite funny. This game has the physical special split, by the way, just in case you're wondering. I don't normally like playing anything before Gen 4 because it doesn't have that. But, you know, this does, so it's fine. Take that. And a Rotom. Can't really do much to this thing with um, with Electivire, but Shockwave will at least do something. Okay, wow, okay. That does more than I thought it would. But poor attacks, Electivire, so that's nice. Hat 2's Confusion, is it going to finish it off? Yes it is, okay, cool. Very nice, Hat 2 is already putting in the work. But there we go, we beat Tommy and Mark. Wow, you've got some potential! Oh man, oh man, I challenge him as one feisty customer! Stop it. Wait, hang on, he has a beard here, but, you know, he's in fight. Okay, never mind. <laughs> he shaved, and then he immediately grew his beard back. Crazy. Okay, let's fight Roxanne. Is it just me, or is he like the only hiker who's in, like, in Battle Sprite doesn't have a beard? I think he might be, actually. Oh look, it's a Garboda that I don't have to worry about, because I have... Confusion and not a uh, fairy type yet. <coughs> I don't know if Hatram is pure psychic in the normal game for that's over here, but it does become fairy later. I looked it up. I only looked up Hatram though, I didn't look up Hatram. Okay, anyway, Confusion's fine. It pretty much murders it. You're using a potion already. Oh yeah, Galboda in the anime has like this really weird voice. It's like, Galboda! Or something like that. <coughs> it's not what I expected at all. I was kind of expecting to just like... Or something like that. But you know, it's like Taurus just moves. You know, it, it literally just moves like a cow. I would much rather it was like... Or something like that. But no, apparently not. <laughs> apparently it's just... Ooh. And like, um... I thought Ampharos would be cool if its voice differed by... Uh, by like, gender. Like, it could have its normal voice if it was a female, but the male one would be like, I'm or something. You know, I thought, oh, that would be pretty cool. And then there's Ponyta and Rapidash who just neigh, though they are horses. I don't know about Wooloo, though, because I don't think Wooloo has appeared in the English dub, so I don't know. But I would imagine it's probably going to just be like, meh, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> it's not going to have a voice. It's just going to be like a stock image of a sheep. Or a stock sound effect of a sheep, rather. I'm pretty sure... That's actually, um, it's cry, like, in the game, it's just a sheep sound. It's <laughs> just a regular sheep noise. Iron Head, already? Really? You have Iron Head at level 12, and it's a crit too. Nice, great, thanks. But, okay, great. And I flinched, because of course I did. Magnitude 7, now you're dead, bye. 
because you're double weak to this, so bye bye, go away, it got you back. I quitted you back, you dickhead, how do you like it? Hat 2 grew to level 14, wow, you've really caught up with everyone really fast. Violet will grew to level 16. <clears throat> what level does um, Numble evolve? I feel like it's 33, but I don't remember. We're trying to learn Slash, well I suppose I might as well learn that for now. Forget Scary Face, you know. It's not a move I see myself using in the future or anything, but... Ouch. Cyndaquil. Um, am I going to be faster than the Cyndaquil? It's funny because I'm shiny hunting this thing on Soul Silver right now. Like, as we speak. No, I'm not faster because it has quick attack. Like, as I'm playing this, I'm also shiny hunting at the same time. I've been looking for it for ages. I haven't found anything yet. So, that's a shame. Rude was poisoned. And uh, Water Pulse is just going to murder this. Bye! See you soon. Hopefully this time you'll be shiny, because that'd be nice. How fitting would it be if I got it on this reset that I'm doing right now? Okay, never mind. <laughs> that would be really funny. That would be like, champion timing. <coughs> so I lost. Seems I still have much more to learn. I understand. The Pokemon League's rules state rules... Okay, anyway, whatever. And I get the badge. It lets you use Cut outside of battle, because yes, I'm totally going to learn that. You don't have to learn HM moves. Also, she gives you a TM, but you can't actually use TMs in this game, so that's weird. Get out! Out of the way! Wait, please! Don't take my goods! All caps as well. There's, you see, there's goods, and there's goods. And it's like that Lionel Hutz meme, where he, like, he nods and he shakes his head. Alright then. Clink. Oh, it's you. You're that fantastic trying to help me in the woods. Help get my goods back. <laughs> What's stopping you from doing it yourself? Are you too scared of them? It's literally a Team Aqua Gun. He's not going to do anything. Hey, hey! It's a shiny Surviper. But, you know, I already have a poison type. So I can't use it. Oh, it's a healing move. Never mind. Can I attack, please? Okay, never mind. Uh, I'm going to use Flame Burst, and if it dies, it dies. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, Life Dew is a healing move. I thought it was an attacking move. I guess not. Oh, well, never mind. It is a water move, interestingly. But yeah, I thought it was an um, attacking move. It's not it's a healing move. That's real problem. Okay, hi Pachirisu, bye Pachirisu, hi Amara, hi Amara, <laughs> Mel Metal, fantastic. There's a Simipaw, no I don't want to catch the Simipaw, I already have a water type. There's that thing. We want to walk Pico and I will jump, ah Pico, he's like, whoa Pico, what are you coming, come get some then. Ah, Keel Hall at all! That hostage Pokemon turned out to be worthless! And to think I made a getaway. You really caught this Wingle thinking it would be the most useful thing in the universe. I mean, yeah, Pelipper's great, it's pretty cool, but like, it's it's a Wingle. It probably doesn't even have any, like, like, it's literally just the guy's pet. It probably doesn't even have any moves. It couldn't even be water gun. Like, what did you think you were going to do with this thing? Explode became confused. Will it hit itself though? That's my question. Hit yourself in the face, coward. Never mind. Disrooming voice. Oh, you have soundproof. Lovely. And then it kills itself by hitting itself anyway, so it doesn't matter. Okay, down. Yeah, it's disrooming voice. <laughs> yeah, again, it's the cow thing. It? Pico, blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool, great. Okay, any Pokemon? It's Melt Metal again. That's uh Durant. That's a weird sprite. That's a Pichu. <laughs> What's with all the like steel and electric types in here all of a sudden? There's Rotom. There's a Grookey. I was kind of expecting Grookey to sound like Ma like Mario Kart Wii Diddy Kong in the anime, but no, it doesn't. I have no idea what that thing was. It appeared for like a split second. And then it was gone. Okay, no, that's not a shiny, it's a full sunflower. 
You can't really tell because it's so small. There's a deli bird, don't really care about that. How'd it go? The Devon Goods, you got them back? Yeah, great. Okay, anyway, blah, blah, blah. Yap, yap, yap. Okay, anyway. Uh, the Mr. Stone's like, yeah, yeah, just go and do stuff. Just send this to Stephen. I'm not reading all the text because I can't be asked. I'd rather just get back to the game, you know? Like, I read the text in my first playthrough, and the second playthrough I just breeze through it all and just play the game. Oh, and also, you can fight May here. Oh, hi. You have a match call feature on your Pokemon. Let's register each other. Alright, time to fight May. Mincino, or Mincino, however it's pronounced. I don't know. And it's going to use Tickle to lower my attack and defense, even though I'm using special moves, so. How much do you want to bet it's going to go for Tail Slap now? No, never mind, it went for Pound. Okay, stop doing that. Okay, anyway. Let me just check to see if it's still. Yeah, okay. Alright, what's next? The blade, okay. I can deal with that. You'll also notice something interesting about this hack. Is that the Pokemon actually have their real cries. Like, there's a lot of hacks out there that have Pokemon from other generations, but they just have, like, an unknown cry. But no, they actually have their proper cries in this game, which is awesome. I don't know if I mentioned that last time, but it is really awesome. And Flame Burst had a really cool animation just now. That was really neat. Really neat. Alright, Ivysaur. That's also dead. Why would you send this out? I'm guessing it's because you don't have anything else that's good against me, right? If your next Pokémon is a water type, you're an idiot for not sending that out first. Ding! Level 17. Execute. Yeah, that's why. You didn't have anything good against me. And awesome flame burst animation. And executes just done. <laughs> it's done for. It's not going to survive that. Not in any world would it live that move. Alright then, anyway. That's that. Yikes, you're better than I expected. Oh, by the way, Mr. Briny, who I just passed? You just moved here, so I might know Mr. Briny was just a revered seafarer. Gee, you're giving me the most obvious things ever. I was like if I went up to you and said, Hey, did you know that we're in the Hoenn region right now? I bet you never knew that. But gee, I gee, I never would have guessed, thanks. Considering he has a boat, I would guess he was a seafarer at one point. Uh, there's Obstagoon. Okay, another Crustle just appears out of nowhere. Is it Crustle or is it Crustle? I think it's Crustle. Hey, <laughs> look, it's a Suicune. No, come here, you. I want to fight you because I'm really close to leveling up. Great, never mind. <laughs> I didn't level up. Hey, look, it's a fan pee. <laughs> and it's dead. And I'm still not leveled up. Okay, yes, I can say most certainly it's the Gen 5 to 7 experience system. Judging by how the fact I'm getting literally nothing from killing these things. Oh yeah, you might as well stay up front. What is that? Oh, it's a Salander. Okay. I couldn't tell because it was just from the back. That's, uh, that's a Drizzile. I've never seen any Pokemon appear in that grass over there. Hey, do you want to give me a free shiny? No? Never mind. It's like, hey, do you want a Binacle? No, I don't want a Binacle. Why would I want that? Imagine if Binacle had like a, a second evolution, like a split evolution, where it becomes water fighting, and it was called Binuckle. <laughs> that'd be cool. Imagine how funny that'd be. Actually, question, what does this guy do? Yeah, I guess. Wait, can you still use the fishing rod in this game? Is that really a thing? Can I still do that? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Yeah, apparently I can. I wasn't expecting that. Never mind. <laughs> Not even a nibble. So yeah, I don't know why, but you can't come in here. Even though it was already in the game anyway. There's a lot of places in this game you can't enter. And all those places have a Conkelda standing in front of them, so... I swear I saw one of them was a shiny Conkelda, but I could have just been, you know, seeing it wrong. There's a lot of grass types I'm noticing all of a sudden. Like, everyone has grass types. 
which means Volcanus is basically just ruling the land at the moment. Having a bit of trouble taking the moves, but yeah, I don't know, she's doing all right. <coughs> Alright, flame burst, pow! He just looks like I throw a bomb at him. Take that. Hey, Volcanus, use grenade attack. Okay, level 17. I lost because I'm trying not to go to the washroom. Never heard anyone call it that before. Never ever. <coughs> anyway, which do you prefer, fishing in the sea or stream? I don't know. <laughs> I don't fish much. Also, I mostly fished in ponds when I was chain fish shiny hunting because, of course, I did. And it lived on one. Can't believe it. A right, disarming voice. Never mind. Fine, just waste confusion PP on this asshole. Just confusion, kill this carnivine. And then there's a vile plume, that's dead in one hit. Alright, Fisherman Elliot, defeated. Oh, I'm defeated. Ah, Pokeball. Very nice. So yeah, you don't need flash in this game. So you can just run straight through here. And you'll be fine. You can just come here as early as you want, that's a Meloetta. <laughs> it just pops up on top of me, there's no way of avoiding that. That was a Swano, I believe. And I saw it for a second, there's a Shroomish. Again, there's Horlucha. One of the coolest Gen 6 Pokemon. Everstone, oh hey look, it's um, Crab Roller, there's Gigalith. Give me a free shiny, there's one! <laughs> Except it's a water type, so I can't use it. And it's dead. Whoops. Again, not too bothered. Shinies are like really common in this game. Oh, and also, in case you're wondering, the um, the uh, what are they called? Paldea starters. They can be shiny in this hack, but obviously, since we don't know what the shiny looks like, they're just the normal ones. Oh, hey, look at this! Shiny Ember. Look at that. And it's dead. <laughs> I already have a fire type. Oh. Oh look, it's Yamper! Very cool, I caught that one! I already have an electric type, so I can't use it, but that's another shiny. Three shinies in the same place. You see, if I didn't have Volcanus, I'd be even more excited about the fact that I found a shiny um, Ember in there, but no, well, whatever. I already have Volcanus, and you know. I would have rather liked to find a shiny of a type I don't have so I can use it on my team. I really hope I'm not going until the end of the game again. Don't you dare brush me off, it's not my fault if you cry. There's a lot of people in this game who said they're going to make you cry. Like, what's your obsession? Battle Girl Laura sent out Cosmo. -um. That is one overpowered cry for Pokemon that can't do any damage. All it can do is cosmic power. And maybe teleport as well. So I'm going to speed this up because we're going to be here a while. Constantly fighting it it keeps setting up all of its defences. Alright, we defeated Battle Girl Laura. Have we come this way? Might is right, come on! Alright, Arbok and it's going to be killed. Killed the Arbok, there we go. Hat 2 is just murdering everything. God damn it. I don't know if it's even possible to skip to these trainers. I don't think I've ever managed to get through this gym without fighting a single one. It's pretty much impossible to do. You can skip some of them though. I am Brawly, Doofus Gym Leader. I've been churned in the rough... Okay, whatever, just fight me. Alright, Brawly, what do you got this time? It's a Grimer. Which means it's dead, because I have confusion at the start of my team. Annihilate it. Okay, never mind, it left on one. And of course it poisoned me too. Just fuck off, man. Okay, next. What's next? Deoxys. Great. Um, <laughs> I guess I'll just go into Palkia. If I see any legendaries I don't have anything super effective against, I'll just go into Palkia. It's probably my best bet. Alright, Deoxys. It's level 19, so they have caught up with me, that's for sure. And Deoxys has absolutely no defense, ever. Like, its defense is terrible. So it's dead. Bye! You didn't stand a chance. Except you did quite a bit of decent damage with Psychic or Nightshade or whatever it was. I think it was Nightshade, actually. 
not even psychic, I was supposed to say confusion, I got the wrong word again, Dubwall. Um, I think that's a normal type, so Violet Will can just low kick it. Will lose evolution, I actually saw this, um, <coughs> this fan-made Wooloo evolution before the game came out called Woolover, and it was a normal dark type, but it was a wolf in sheep's clothing. I really wish that was a real Pokemon. That would be so much cooler. Dubbull is just a bigger sheep, you know? Maybe it's a ram, I don't know. But, like, Woolover is such a cool idea. That was really cool. I wish that was real, but sadly it's not. Thunder Wave. Hey, what do you know? The move I was, all, I was talking about earlier, I now have it. I can use that later to catch a shiny if I find one. Specifically one of a type I don't have yet. Okay, now I don't want to learn Amnesia. I don't usually use moves that raise stats or lower stats, because, I don't know. I just prefer damaging moves, which is why I never won much online. Blah blah blah, stuff, fighting gem, pull cup, etc. Okay, anyway. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you can't skip that trainer there. I'm pretty sure you can't avoid her in any way. Like, there's no way to avoid that trainer. Can't avoid them at all. Alright then, anyway. Slate part, let's go. Alright, time to switch my lead, I think. Let's put Rude up front so we can just murder everything I find. I've laid anchor in parts all around the world, but Slate Port's the best! Is it because there's a beach, by any chance? Sailor Huey sent out Surfetched. Is it weird that the only other port town I can think of is um, Vermilion City in Kanto? Probably. Well, you're a fighting type, so yep. <laughs> Never mind, it's dead anyway. Rude is trying to learn Power Gem. That's really good. <laughs> Already, level 19. There's something, the only problem I have with this thing is, um, it's always like, what moves do I teach? You know, you want to have a dragon and water move. I always like to have earth power, right? But do I teach Power Gem or Aura Sphere? I never know. I feel like Power Gem, probably. Alright, this guy's gonna burp at me. Oh hey, you've got a Palkia too, but it's much lower level, so I killed it. And then they just fight these random kids. And absolutely obliterate them, by the way, because Delphox is dead to Ward's Pulse, Shuppet's just really weak because it's a baby. I don't know, it's not actually a baby Pokemon, but... It's small, so it's baby. Alright, oh, there's a kid there too. Oh, it's a double. Uh, I think I'm just going to Dragon Breath that, and then obviously Shockwave the Trumbi. There we go, instant win. Never mind, it's not over yet. Dragon Breath you. Actually, no, go back. Go back. Power Gem Articuno, because it's double too, super effective. There we go. That's how you do it. Alright, time to switch my lead again. <laughs> Back to Hat 2. And I found a potion! Hello there. Hello there. I'm going to show you how great a Pokemon are, but don't cry. Do you see what I mean? There's so many people who reference making you cry in this game. I didn't learn Psybeam because I'm a moron. I'm not lying, I am an idiot. I didn't learn Psybeam over Confusion because I'm dumb. And I always make dumb mistakes, all the time. It's a wonder I'm even still playing any games. I'm supposed to have a quit yet. Is there Aura, a Pokemon that should be fighting type but isn't? Alright, Razor Leaf. It's better than Vina Whip, so... Oh hey, a Victini. And it's gone. You know what would be really funny? Imagine if I found a shiny Arceus, or a shiny Darkrai. How cool would that be? It would be very cool, but, you know, I'd be there trying to catch it all day, so. And he gives you some soda pop, alright. I am going to buy more Pokeballs, though, because I feel like I might need them, you never know. I think I can leave town as well, to go and look for some more Pokemon, potentially. I don't know if I'm allowed to do that, I'm going to have a look, you know. 
I'm gonna find out. Can I leave town? I can. Okay, cool. I'll tell you. You're not a trainer, are you? No. Okay, anyway. Uh, Infernape. Dowimaka. Dowimaka's awesome. Stoutland. Uh, another Crocorock. Another shiny Woobat. I don't want that. I already have one. Unpheasant. Uh, Milsuri or Milkery, however it's pronounced. Servine. Heracross is pretty cool. I love a shiny one of those. Uh, Sandshrew. Mienfu. That's an Oshawott. Chatot. Don't want a Chatot. <coughs> That's a Carfish. Kamala. That is a shiny Weezing. I'm going to murder it because they already have a poison type, but still. Uh, that's a Stonky. Centret. I think that's a Timpole. Ho oh! -oh. <laughs> uh, that's a shiny Kadabra, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Um, but I already have. I already have this thing now. I already have a Psyche type, so you're dead too. Give me a shiny of a type I don't have, please. I don't feel like I'm asking for a whole lot here. The shiny odds are high, so... Yeah, give me give me one of those. A shiny Polygon too. That's a Whiskash. That's a Greedent. That's, that's a Xerneas. It's just a Hophip. Meow. Actually, here's a question. Are there Lowland forms in this game? I don't think I've seen a single one, so I don't think they are. They might be. But, I've, like I said, I've played this game like four times and I haven't, I haven't seen a single one. Lavatar. Beware would be also pretty cool. Uh, Gumi. I already have a dragon though. That's a, that's a Shellos. That's a Panzer. That's a Rillaboom. There's Dusclops. That's a Fioni, I think. Metang. Shiny Metang would be cool, but I already have a Psychic type, so never mind. That's Roserade. That's du Duraladon, I think it's called. Yeah. I think that's how it's pronounced. Yveltal. <laughs> ah, look at this. A Shiny Harlucha. Well, I don't have a... Um, I don't have a Fighting type, so... Yeah, why not? Thunder Wave. There we go. Cool. That's actually neat. Very cool. Booyaka. Okay, Mysterio has plus special attack. Actually, no, hang on. Hang on, that wasn't... No, plus special defense. Minus physical attack, because of course it is. You just have to keep, keep giving me shit natures. But, you know, whatever. At this point, I don't really give a shit. I've just stopped caring. It's only a casual playthrough. It's not like I'm... It's not like it's going to matter too much. But it's still very annoying. I'll tell you what else, though. Nothing is more annoying than hunting a shiny for months. And then, when you get it, it's the worst nature it could be, you know? So, like natures don't really matter because I'm not going <coughs> to play online or anything. But still. It still bothers me. Cracked pot. He gives you a cracked pot instead of thief. Prepare for expedition now. Oh no. He he hold it, we'll be taking those parts. Okay, and then we fight Team Aqua. It's a Chandelure, a Pokemon I would rather like. Because I really like Chandelure. <coughs> <coughs> Except I already have a fire type, so. And yeah, I'll, I'll just destroy a Luxray with confusion. There we go. Also, if you were wondering, the cheat mode that you saw in the uh, options on episode 1. If you pick that, you can give yourself any Pokemon and you can make it a shiny if you want, so that's pretty cool. I don't know what I would give myself. I always have trouble picking a team. Oh no. Um, I'm sure I've met you somewhere before. Ah, I've introduced myself to you. I'm not my name Scott. Ah, I just saw Team Echo run away from me here like they were stung. Oh, let me guess you'd them later. Hmm. Uh. <laughs> okay, anyway. Just <laughs> leave. Okay, anyway. Moving on.
And the professor's like, where's my daughter? Are you are you not travelling with her? The answer is no, I'm not. <coughs> Alright, Mysterio. Time for you to get some experience, I hope. Alright, Karate Chop, there's Violus. Shockwave, the Beldum. Neat. Okay, it survived, but whatever. It won't survive another move, so it's okay. Take that. <coughs> and it didn't try to use Dragon Rage, which is nice. And then Firo will just murder it. There we go, bye. Trying to learn Aerial Ace, so I'll forget Wing Attack for that, because it's basically the same move. It's got the same power, but Aerial Ace doesn't miss. Halucha! Alright. I'm going to fight these guys over here. I'm going to fight Mei. I'm going to make my way over to, um... To Morville. And then I'll end the episode off. Alright, um... Karate Chop you and Shockwave the Archer. There we go, that's pretty cool. Alright, take that. Alright, this guy's gonna have a... he's got a Lombre, kill that. Oh, there we go, that's murdered. Okay, that guy's gonna fight me. Uh, Articuno. Uh, never mind, I don't think I can... There's anything I can do against this. Flame Burst. There we go. It's dead. Lava Plume. 70, 80. Okay, it's more powerful, I'll take that. How's that coming out? Cincino. Okay, could you not be a dickhead, please? Thank you. Alright, go away. And you have a Stunky too, that's dead. Lava Plume looks like it has a really cool animation too. Also, there's a Snorlax over here. <laughs> uh, you can't actually fight it. I'm guessing it's just there to block whatever that is until later. I would imagine. I found a dire hit, some great. Yeah, I'm definitely going to use that. Alright, this guy has Marlow, kill that. Now, he has a Thunderous, which is um, interesting. Oh, there goes Thunderous. Lampern, it's too late. And Frostlass, too. Alright, time to fight May. What you got? Poliwhirl. Alright, um, I'm going to go into Groot because Violet Will's one level higher. Get some XP on this thing. Bubble does two damage. Oh, I'm so threatened. Razor Leaf. Dead. There goes Poliwhirl. Like, do you really not have Bubble Beam yet? Like, really? Why would you use Bubble? <laughs> right, what's next? Gengar! Alright, what do I do against Gengar? I guess I do have Hat too. I've used Gengar a lot too recently. Gengar! Alright, confusion time. And I'm also going to get confused. Get confusioned! If I had Psybeam, that would have killed. There goes the Gengar. Gengars get really annoying in randomizers at later levels because they have bloody Destiny Bond. I consider Destiny Bond to be like the ultimate pussy tactic, but you know. Well, maybe maybe besides spamming evasion moves. Uh, Petrat, that's fine. That's not threatening at all. I'm going to stay in for this. Kill it. It's using Protect. It's also a coward move. Stop it. Take that. And Hypnosis too. Why is it that, why does the AI always land like hypnosis and sleep powder and dark void and shit like that? Like why does the AI always land it every time? I don't know why I didn't go into Mysterio for Patrap, but whatever. I don't know, it'd probably just be being dumb again. I right, just karate chopped this pony out. It's double weak to it, so and it's a crit too. <laughs> okay, the crit was maybe a bit unnecessary, but I'll take it. Alright, Mysterio with level 20. And is trying to learn Encore. <laughs> no, I don't want to learn Encore. Why would I want that move? Alright, Electric is the last Pokemon. I don't think I really need to be afraid of it. Karate Chop. Okay, ne never mind. Maybe I do need to be a little afraid. Alright, Lava Plume. Kapow. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that did not look how I expected. 
Yeah, you know what? Flame Burst had a better animation than that. <laughs> I'll be honest. Flame Burst was cool though. Alright. Yikes, you're better than I expected. And she's like, hey, have a dowsing machine. And then she calls it an item finder. Great job, May. Which which one is it? Could I see your Pokemon? No. You have to close your eyes the entire fight. I didn't actually mean to use home claws, but whatever. Uh, area lace to break the, the disguise. Then kill it. He used baby doll eyes, so I went back to my normal attack. Uh, Roly Cole is part rock, so I can just karate chop that. Shield on needs to fuck off. Go away. There we go, that's dead. Oh look, it's smiley face! I always like the fact that <coughs> that Mantic has a smiley face. I actually once did a randomizer where um, I found a Mantic, but like, as you know, in a randomizer it's kind of hard to evolve a Mantic because you need a Rem Raid in your team. And, you know, good luck finding one of them in a randomizer. So what I did was I used... I, I named it Smiley Face and I just used a Mantic on my team for the entire game. It wasn't very good, obviously, because it was a baby, but... It was fun to try, you know? It, it was fun to just have a random baby on my team because I can. Alright, Gloom, Aerial Ace, that's dead. Uh, that's a fucking Reshiram. Yikes. Uh, don't murder me, please. Magnitude 8 and it's dead. Uh, Clay Doll, I can just go into group for this, I suppose, because I'm probably going to outspeed it anyway. Okay, cool. And then Ekans, Hat 2, she's going to murder it. Unless it's faster, which it isn't. Alright, neat. Anyway, get out of my way. So, by the way, uh, there's a guy who's blocking the the rock smash thing. Unless you talk to this guy, he normally gives you rock smash. But he gives you an upgrade. But you have to talk to him, otherwise you can't, like, do the thing. Also, the same is true for strength as well. So what I might do is I might fight the gym now. But we do have to fight Wally, though. Sadly, he, do he doesn't have his awesome theme. That's only the final fight in Horas when he has that. Oh look, it's a Kyurem. Okay, Kyurem, fuck off, bye. <laughs> Alright, Aqua Ring. No, I don't want to... No, I don't want to learn Aqua Ring. Alright, Giraffe Rig, I don't know, I guess I'll just Dragon Breath that. I suppose. Uh, Drill Bro, I can just Water Pulse it. Uh, Lady Bro, I can Power Gem. Pikachu, I guess I'll just Dragon Breath that, I suppose. Uh, blah blah blah. Your friends are that and shoot. Listen, mate, I don't know why you feel the need to follow me around, alright? Leave me alone. And leave him alone, too. You creep. Uh, so, sadly, you do have to fight this guy. There's no avoiding it. So, I guess I might as well just murder his Pokemon, right? Shockwave, dead. Like, Wooloo, that's also dead. Excuse me, die, thank you. I guess Wooloo's really bulky. Then I have to leave because he's blocking the fucking route. Then come back around and accidentally fight these guys! Yay! Way to waste my time. A Barraskewder, dead. Panseer, also probably dead. Never mind, it lived because of course it did. Alright, just switch team, switch target, you kill that, you kill that. And then we're still not done because there's more Pokemon. Unpheasant, dead, goodbye. Now fuck off. No, I don't want to learn Heal Pulse. Why would I want that? Ah, yes. Let me just heal my opponent real quick. Alright, time to fight Watson. <clears throat> Let's see how we do here. Umbreon. I started with the right Pokemon. Kling. Karate Chop. I like the shiny sound in this game. The, an the animation is pretty cool too. Uh, Confuse Ray. Great. Don't hit yourself, please. Apparently you're not listening to me. I said don't hit yourself and then you proceed to hit yourself like an idiot. Just stop it. There we go, Karate Chop Umbreon's dead. Okay, next up is Electrode. You're not going to have Magnet Rise yet, so I can just do that. Magnitude 6, okay, that's probably going to survive. Yep, it lived on 1, because of course it did. Then you're going to heal, so I get magnitude 9 and by. That's dead. Frogadier. That's also easy to deal with. 
Razor Leaf. Obviously it's faster because it's a ninja fog, why wouldn't it be? Groot used Razor Leaf. There we go, just... And then it's a Crocodile to skill it, please. Okay, goodbye. Alright, cool. Dynamo Badge. Whatever. Alright, I don't want to fight anyone on this route because I'm not interested. Never mind. Of course, it would be the Flocker with six Pokemon, wouldn't it? Alright, well, whatever. Berm is dead. Kill the Starly. She's got a Tarakion for some reason. Alright, a Marowak. That's not dead yet, but now it is. Uh, Hanzo's Aerial Ace, that's dead in one hit. Uh, Sprigatito 3 is also dead. That's the, um, in case you hadn't guessed yet, that's the placeholder for Sprigatito's final evolution. Skip that guy. Don't want to fight her either. Just come here. That's the Pokemon, you idiot. Right, and then come in here. Can't skip this guy, because of course I can't. So I have to fight him and his incredibly weak Kranidos. He also has a Pre-Marina, which is just dead already. Goodbye. He also has a Togetic. That's gone too. Oh yeah, you have to come in here, otherwise you can't use Strength later. So, Shatter that. It gives you a Protector. And then he mentions that you can now use Strength. Alright then. There's a bunch of bugs in this cave. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. HP up, alright. Uh, who could use that? Uh, they're all in the training bag. Uh, you have... Never mind. Guess I'll give it to you then. What, does this normal have like max HP EVs or something? I suppose so. Maybe it does. Maybe that's why it has no effect at level 25. Still has no effect. Alright then, anyway. So I think I'm going to end it here. However, I'm going to get past these two. And those guys as well. Don't care about the wind straights. I'll put myself here so I know where I'm going next time. And there we go.